Why is your car temperature gauge high but car not overheating? The temperature gauge helps regulate the hotness of your engine and informs you. Under normal circumstances, your temperature gauge should read around the middle, indicating that your engine isn't too hot or too cold. Sometimes, the temperature gauge works appropriately, and high reading can mean the engine is overheating. However, the gauge can mess things up in some cases. Quickly click on the subscribe button, like, and share, I will be back after the break. What can cause my temperature gauge to be reading high? Failed temperature sensor Broken temperature gauge Low coolant or air in system Failed temperature sensor The temperature sensor helps measure the temperature of the engine. You may be getting a false reading if the temperature gauge is giving a high reading, when the engine is not overheating. This means that the temperature sensor may have malfunctioned or been failing. If you get a false high temperature reading, clean and check your temperature sensor. Broken temperature gauge The needle of the temperature gauge can break if It gets stuck in the hot section and breaks. Grease causes it to stick. One of the stepper gears in the gauge gets broken. Low coolant or air in head gasket failure. The head gasket is responsible for sealing the coolant, combustion chamber, and engine oil pass. Your car temperature gauge may increase if you have a faulty head gasket. Faulty water pump. The water pump is a vital component of the car's cooling system. The water pump helps to push the coolant throughout the cooling system. The water pump can break down causing improper coolant flow. Check your temperature sensor and ensure it is clean and working properly. Check the fuses too to ensure none is disconnected. Then ensure the coolant or air in the system is blowing properly. To fix this problem, you may need to consult your vehicle manual to locate wires and components. You need to first check for diagnostic trouble codes DTC, if the check engine light is on. The codes may point to the source of the problem. It is important to turn the ignition switch off before unplugging wires. Then turn the ignition switch on to check the gauge or warning light response to prevent damage to the computer. Then turn the ignition switch off and unplug the sending unit electrical connector. Then turn the ignition switch on. After doing the steps above, the gauge should indicate cold whether the engine is warmed up or cool. Using a jumper wire, ground the signal wire then turn the ignition switch on. The gauge should read hot. The sending unit may be bad if the temperature gauge responds, but not when connected to the sending unit. You should unplug the wire at the temperature gauge if the gauge indicates higher than cold, when you unplug the sending unit. If the reading of the gauge is cold, the wire is shorted. If the gauge still states higher than cold, you may need to replace the gauge. If the gauge fails to indicate hot when the wire is grounded, Check the circuit fuse again. If you are getting high readings when your engine isn't overheating, then check the temperature sensor and mechanical part of the temperature gauge. If your engine is still overheating, then you need to get it checked out by a professional mechanic to prevent major damage to your vehicle. Please don't forget to click on the subscribe button.